So boom guys, in this video we're going to be doing a profit and loss video with the mini tins. What we're going to do is, we're going to open an art set which is 5 tins. So let's get 5 tins out. I thought it was just another excuse to kind of open some more uh, mini tins uh, or any Crown Zenith products in general. I think the picture is in order there. Is that, it looks, yeah that is it. So if you put all the tins together like that, it will make that picture. So that's something I didn't show you before. Uh, but you can do the same with the art cards and yeah i, I thought because obviously we've opened the case already and an excuse to open more on the channel is a profit and loss video or any kind of video title so like usually i'll do like a 5 10 20 30 as you might see with celebrations we went a bit hardcore with that one but kind of just switch up the titles a bit and you guys always love to see a profit and loss video because obviously we show you the values of the singles in this particular video it comes very useful so the prices on the screens of when we pull any single cards will be the time of upload. Obviously, it can vary to be worth more or less in a couple weeks or years to come. Uh, but yeah, the values will be what is the value at the current day. So, I'll say, or we'll start with the Cherizor one as always. Uh, but yeah, obviously, we only incorporate the value of the hits uh, and promos. However, with this tin, we don't have any promos, but we do have stickers we have stickers and this card here uh i don't tend to sell these myself um but you could that's another way you can make a couple of quid uh, if you sell all your stickers and these cards if people do buy them i used to try and sell them on my ebay they were very hard sales back in the day um so i don't know if they're still very if they do sell so if they do sell you can get some money there but we won't incorporate that in the value another thing you can sell is the tins the tins i think i got a bulk rate about 70p for my recent lot i sold to my bulk buyer so you can sell mini tins in bulk to, from 50p to a pound um so you can actually get a little bit for that obviously it's only worth selling in bundles and if the buyer is going to pay for shipping otherwise they're going to be a pain or take most of your profit shipping these but yeah again with the singles it doesn't incorporate ebay fees or shipping just the current listed prices uh market rates on ebay uh, but yeah let's get into this guys so we're gonna have 10 packs a little fun opening today just because there's a lot of cards i kind of need from this set uh, the gold cards, the Mewtwo, I've managed to get a trade, but I haven't pulled one, but I would love to pull one on the channel. Uh, but yeah, let's see what we got. Okay, starting off, we got a full art, Hisui and Samurai V. Not a bad one. I'm not sure the value of this, but alone, because these are £10, all you need is like one good hit to kind of beat, make you go over that, especially a full art. Most full arts, I feel, are around that £10 range. So literally, you need one full art in a tin and you're going to make a profit so obviously we've got a few tins here some tins we might be taking out some tins uh we can just pull a full out just like that and then obviously the values were on the screen for that one and we'll do the total value so there's five tins here 10 pound a tin that's 50 pounds you've got to beat 50 pounds so if i went to the shop today and spent 50 quid that can i beat that in pools uh, you'll be surprised with this set there's a lot of value in there if you watch some of our other previous uh, profit and loss videos with crown zenith we've actually made double on some products so i'm not gonna spoil which videos those are so check it out guys but yeah rock rough or cherubi okay right hand hollow so the hollows are worth a little bit not too much but we we like to i like to sell them personally and it's gonna help us a little bit so yeah we've got a right hand hollow like i said hollows are not going to be worth too much so boom let's go yeah, I wanted to show you this one as well. So if you peel this off the back, you got the full art there that you can see. And it's got a little bit of glue in the middle, but you know what I mean? That's the full, all the five art tins together will make that artwork. So again, we got the card and sticker there. So like I said, let me know if you do sell them on your eBay. Are you successful selling them? Maybe it'll help others in the down below. But tin number two. So first tin, I don't know the values till I edit the video. So I'd be intrigued to see if that summer is going to help us beat that £10 for that tin. Um, but yeah, let me know if you know in the chat. But yeah, you probably see the price anyways. Uh, but come on, Tangela, Baltoy, Meow, Energy Search. Okay, Agron Hollow. Again, Hollow Res. It's going to help a little, but not. it's not really going to help at all. Because they're only worth around £1 to £2. After shipping and fees as well. Um, but yeah, every it all adds up. It all adds up. That's all that matters. And we just want to kind of pull one of them top top hits and see what we can get kind of so let's go guys let's see what we got here so we've got salazzle ultra ball ryalu starly saita amolga young goose bidoof and an iron guru so that tin would have been an l if we just incorporated the value of that one tin because we got something not worth as much but yeah we can work out average we did open the display so you can see 10 but i am waffling a little bit just because it's five tins 
I'm gonna do this minute to video to eight minutes. You know how it is, guys. <laughs> but yeah, let's go. So boom, stickers. I like to put the stickers aside because I want to give them out maybe on my streams or something. So I've been putting those stickers aside. So maybe we can do something with them. I've been sticking the cherries I'd one on my printer. Uh, I'll probably stick some more somewhere else. But yeah, you can also sell code cards. It's another thing you can sell to help you beat the retail value. Um, but yeah, I, I don't incorporate in the, uh, in, I'm not incorporating in this video in particular. Maybe in the future videos I can. Um, but yeah, like I said, guys, Pearl Lion and the Yam Mega. But like I said, guys, obviously I do these profit and loss videos just for fun. It's not always about profit and loss. You guys can see the amount I open. Majority of times we're not going to make profit, but obviously I do enjoy opening enough. I only use it as a video title excuse, but I'm seeing. I don't know if you can saw that, guys. I don't want to spoil it, but I think we might be in the profit here, guys. Overall, let's see what we got. Come on. I did see something, and there's only one type of rarity with that shine. All right, we've got to execute. Rock, rock. Arceus V Golden. Let's go, guys. This is definitely going to help us. So I don't know the values of these. I haven't pulled one. This is my first one I've pulled. So far, we pulled the Garatina and Dialga. Like I said, there's still many cards I need for my collection. That's why it's an excuse to open. I've got Garatina got Dialga. So I need Arceus and Palkia. Uh, to put. And Arceus is my personal favorite. There's a little thing on the top. I don't know if you can see it there. We'll see if that comes off. Um, boom, so yo, that's looking flawless as well. Oh, there's a line there. You see that little line there? Let's see if that passes a PSA 10. Uh, but I straight out the pack like that. Ooh. So yeah, I only got one. That's why I'm inspecting the, the condition so much. Usually I'm not too bothered, but because it's my one and only one, I just thought I'd inspect it a little bit. But yeah, this is definitely going to help us. It might even be worth more than 50 pounds. Five tins will cost us 50 pounds. If you don't know, you can buy these on famouscrow.com. Link in the description, 10 pounds a tin while stocks last. Um, but yeah, this one card might pay for every single tin. And then whatever else we got, if we sell this, everything else works out free. So you can look at it like that. But yeah, this is going to be a successful video. I even forgot about the Zerud here. So let's go put Zerud Hollow there. Like I said, the Hollow is just a little extra. There's nothing going to break the bank or going to help us much, but we may as well include them. All right, got the Wooloo and a card here. So boom. Just thought I'd show you in case you haven't watched it. Watch the display opening. It wasn't a bad pull. The pull rates were insane, actually. Pull rates were very insane. But glad to pull a gold card there. Absolutely insane. But let's see what other full arts we can get. I always say the mini tins really have a really, really good pull rate. Uh, so, uh, like celebrations, I was just I had so many I was just cracking them for fun, and I'd always pull a banger. Like majority of the times, it would be profit in a tin. Um, so I'm hoping this set's gonna be similar. Uh, but yeah, let's go, let's go, let's see what we can get. Boom. So yeah, one step. I need to make a set list and work out what I need left from the set because I, I absolutely have no clue what I need left. Um, but yeah, I use the Poke Collector app. It's a really good app to keep track of the the, uh, the sets and stuff and what cards you have and what you need. Oh, that tin was zero. Zero hits in there. That would have been uh, just a total loss. But then again, you can also sell bulk, but you're only going to get a couple of pence out of that as well. And this is why we only incorporate the values of hits, because it's just easier to sell in this. Um, but then, yeah, let's go. Marnie one, final one today, guys. I already guessed with the that Arceus there, so really happy with that. So, yeah, this is just an art set. Five tins, not a display. So, half a display. You went to the shop, bought half a display. You went on my website, just bought five tins. That's maybe what you can expect. Obviously, pull rate's always random. Pulls are always random. Um, but yeah, final tin here. This is the Marnie tin, guys. Let's go. Shinx, Lava Star, Oddish, Seal, Yan Mega, and a Calyrex Hollow. So just a Hollow Red. Right At least we got something. We're not walking away with nothing in that one. All right, second one here. You can also order the tins in our box break. Uh, so we have a limited amount of tins available. We only got a few. I think there's a shortage of them uh, just because of delay in delivery, but there's going to be more coming later down the line. So if you want some for release weekend, uh, make sure to grab my ASAP. But I think this video might go live the week, oh, the, after the, the stream I'm talking about, but we should have some still. But oh, Luxray and a Leopard. So only one hollow there. So the last two tins weren't great. In five tins, we've got four hollows and then two uh, full art GG cards. So we've got the Golden Arceus and the Samurai here. So the total value of everything we pulled today is on the screen right now. And the retail value was £50. So uh, 
when I edit it, I want to see the total, actual total value. But I can imagine the Arceus is going to be more than £50 alone, right? So we're definitely in the profit. So it's a, another great video. Crown Zero has been decent to us. So yeah, definitely go back, check out other profit and loss videos with other sets. And if you like Crown Zenith, then um, we've got more Crown Zenith for the V, the, e, the V boxes, the ETB. And I'm about to do the Pikachu uh, V Max box, wherever that is. So but I'm gonna crack this open right now, do a profit and loss with two of those. So if you wanna stay tuned for that, make sure to like and subscribe. I'm glad to add a card I really, really badly needed in the collection today. So guys, like, subscribe. Hopefully you like this video. Let me know what you think about this video style or give me any other ideas I can do with product like versus what products should I do versus between uh, et cetera, et cetera. But guys, like, subscribe, and I'll catch you next one. Peace.